Danny, 2 0 win over Matt Lock in our first pre season game. What do you make of that? I think it's the old cliches come out about minutes under the belt and no injuries. It's a nice pitch, it's a real good opposition. I think they were unlucky in the playoffs last year not to go up to the, the National North, so it was always going to be a tough game, which is what you need. Uh, we've had a mix in our three games. We played a, a 23s, a League Two team, and now a, a Northern Premier, a strong Northern Premier team. So we want to come here and win, really. I think you saw we kept a lot of the team on for 60. I think Manny played over 70 minutes because we want to get the game over the line. And obviously, we're lucky we've got a game Tuesday where those who didn't play so long today can, uh, can get a bit of time under their belt. But no, good, good exercise. Glad to see uh, the ball in the net, especially from, from Dobbs, the new signing. Loads of fans, which is great. You know, they're still here now having a beer and enjoying themselves, and that's what pre season's all about. Absolutely. And then you mentioned Dobbs, we've got to talk about him. What did you make of his performance? I think he showed today, I mean, obviously, that the gaffer knows him a lot better than me because he worked with me at Ipswich and speaks very highly of him. But I think you see today he's got all the makings of a fan's favourite, albeit after one pre season friendly. Uh, I think you look at him and you expect him to be a bit of a flair player but yeah. what people I don't think expect is to see him running back and tackling and trying to win headers and yeah. marking at corners and, and that's the stuff I think which is going to endear him to all the Chesterfield supporters. See. And then is that what you wanted from today then? Just a win, you know, a, a tough a tough game and more importantly minutes under the belt? Yeah, I think it's topping up, uh, topping up the fitness but you know you don't want to come here and lose and not play very well and then all of a sudden uh, that casts a, a, a grey cloud over the fact they have got minutes in the leg. So, you know, all in all, it's been a very good day. And how important is performances individually in pre-season games like this today? Well, it's important. I think you've seen we've got a very strong squad. I think there's virtually two positions in uh, two players, sorry, for every position up for grabs. So it's important that everyone gives it their best because you know the manager and us as staff have got to be ruthless come the first game at Dorking and pick what we think is going to be the best 11. And then Joe Quigley obviously got on the score sheet as well. What did you make of his performance and his goal? I think it's been good for Joe. I mean, ever since Joe's come in the building, you know, he, he would have liked to have scored a lot more goals last year, but he's, no one could question his work rate or his honesty. And he's brought that so far pre-season and added a couple of goals. So uh, we've got a good player with Joe. And uh, a note on the, the the guys that missed out, Kabongo, Shamanga, Jack Clark, Carline, Danny Rowe and Manny Olicki. Any update on any of those guys? I think Manny will be a bit of a long-termer. Danny Rowe hopefully will be uh, sooner than later. Uh, Cabs hopefully sooner than later. Jules Carline hopefully sooner than later. So, you know, we've come from a bad place of injuries last year for, for, for a variety of reasons. And it's important this year, especially over pre-season, we don't try and break them. You know, the, the Gaffers pre-season has been really tough, one of the toughest I've seen but without breaking them and pushing them beyond the point of, of fitness. So it's all very well getting them fit, but we don't want to get fit lads who, you know, are on the treatment table. And then finally from me, we've got to give it a mention, the, the Ernie Moss Challenge Cup. It's a, a brilliant cause, obviously, for, for a brilliant player who played for Chesterfield. And, and what did you make of that, the whole day as a whole? And obviously, first piece of silverware under the belt, and yeah, hopefully there'll be some more to yeah, come this season. In. We've got the open bus tour tomorrow at 12 o'clock, <laughs> everyone, get yourselves out. No. Fingers crossed. I think it's, it ticks so many boxes today in terms of, you know, the weather, the fans, you know, the reason for the trophy, which is absolute Chesterfield legend new players on display everyone's in good spirits you know but everyone does know that the cause of this game in the long run is to, is to go to Dorking and get three points so it's still early stages of pre-season but you know as you well know before you know it it's the first league game of the season